worried though. I'm worried about where our world is coming to, like what our troops are going to be forced to do. He's, oh, you guys know that North Korea has nuclear bombs now. Yeah. Let me say that again for the people in back who are looking. <laughs> North Korea has nuclear bombs. Yeah. I would feel so much better about North Korea having nukes if they also had a heavyweight fighter who Rocky Balboa could go over there and defeat. <laughs> and teach those Koreans. Fuck it, Jesus. The youth could change. <laughs> Everybody could change! <laughs> I saw Rocky IV. You know, after Rocky defeated Ivan Drago, five years later, the Soviet Union fell. <laughs> Rocky defeated communism. Send him to Korea. Bravo. Hey, when Rocky III came out, the Bengal tiger was on the endangered species list. Hey, you angry. <laughs> But after Rocky used the eye of that animal to defeat Mr. T, the tiger flourished. Rocky defeated extinction, sent him to Korea. Rocky V, Rocky V, Tommy Morrison went into the movie HIV positive. After Rocky beat him, he tested HIV negative. Rocky beat the AIDS out of him, sent him to Korea. Rocky can do anything! I want to see Rocky beating up an SUV in the parking lot, just <laughs> Yo, I'm beating global warming. <laughs> you go, Rock! <laughs> he needs to go to Korea, because that place is messed up, man. Because think of the leaders we know. We knew, like, Hitler in World War II. Scary. Joseph Stalin in the Soviet Union. Scary. Have you seen Kim Jong-il, the leader of North Korea? Yeah. He's cute. <laughs> He looks like a little Pokemon. I just want to tickle him like... Hello, Misa, Misa, hello. Hello. He wears those big Asian Mrs. Doubtfire glasses. He stares at you in the sun. You'll burst into flames. He does not look like a communist dictator. He looks like a lesbian tennis player from the 70s. Hey. Is that Billie Jean King? It's Kim Jong-il, get over here. Come on, you're at Tamagotchi, time to feed you. Boop, thank you. Thank you.